show is Lala Wood, and I'm here on the set of the wonderful Norm Show. Yes, Norm Crosby has a show, and it's shot every day at Warner Brothers. And here is the wonderful cast member, Mar Marty Lang. No, it's Artie. Artie it's Lang. Artie, yeah. Yeah, yeah. How wonderful it is to be who you are. <laughs> Yeah. I, Who are you exactly? What is your background? You you were a teamster originally. And I was actually a longshoreman. Longshoreman! <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, I hope that isn't too much information for us to know. <laughs> because I've been to the shore, and when they're long, you can't help but notice. Let me ask you something. You work with the wonderful Ben Stiller. Uh, no. You well, didn't work with Ben Stiller. Oh, no, I did, actually. I was in the movie Mystery Men. Mystery Men Mystery with Men, Ben yeah. Stiller. <laughs> yeah. And... And Paul Rubens. Is that true? You were in the film with Paul Rubens? Pee, Pee Wee Herman. Pee Wee Herman. <laughs> yeah, he was. I who's, don't who's Pee Wee Herman? He's Paul Rubens. Paul Rubens. <laughs> yeah, yes. Right. No, I know Paul Rubens. R oh, you do? Well, I don't know Paul, but I know his <laughs> his agent, a wonderful boy named Blackie. Uh, <laughs> and I met him once at a at a at a, at a kind of a beef and and, and jerky place right. in the, in the uh, near in, near Malibu. <laughs> and we were sitting there talking. I said, "Who you represent?" And he said, "I represent Shields from Shields and Yarnell, oh, right. and I represent Paul Rubens." <laughs> I said, "Oh my God, Paul Rubens, who's he?" And he said, "Pee Wee Herman." <laughs> And, and then and then I remembered the scandal because I think I think Hollywood scandals are a shame, Marty. Don't you think? Ar <laughs> Artie. Artie. Yeah. Don't you think Hollywood scandals are scandalous in a way? Uh, yeah, absolutely. I mean, especially with the, what happened to Paul Rubens was a little embarrassing. What happened to Paul Rubens? He was caught, uh, you know, in a theater. <laughs> oh no! Yeah. And what was the? And let me guess. The film was Tess. The film was uh, Captain Ron. <laughs> Captain Ron, oh, I, I think that's fun, that Kurt, Kurt Russell. <laughs> and a wonderful eye patch with a stern attitude and a, and a certain waves that, that make you want to sleep and reflect. You worked, you worked on the wonderful Lost and Found with David Spade. Right, he's yeah. mean. Yeah, he was pretty mean. Is it because he's so tiny? I think so. I think he has like he's, a, a he's, Napoleon thing. A you know? Napoleon thing. Right. Yeah. With a full wig. <laughs> I think, uh, yeah, I think yes, it's a full he wig. He once was very mean to me at, 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 at an opening, and I, I was stunned because I didn't, and I didn't know who he was. Oh, really? And so he took that as, he took umbrage. <laughs> and he stopped me before you know it, he's making fun of my wife, Dixie, and my four boys, Morgan Mason, Matthew, and Modine. And I didn't know what to say. Like, hold on, please. Sorry, this, no, that's okay. Don't worry about it. I, don't, I give this number out to so few. <laughs> and, when, and when it rings, I, I'm always curious. But I think the phone is like that. Uh, yeah. Hello. <laughs> oh, hi, Dixie. How are you? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that's wonderful. <laughs> Morgan got his driver's license. Oh, that's great. <laughs> Tell Modine I said hi. Marty Lange says hello to Modine. <laughs> well, we must have, must, let's get a cake in. Let's get cake and candle then. And we'll do it in the shape of a car. <laughs> That's wonderful. We, oh, she hung up. <laughs> she hung up. She hung up. She hung up. She the how brightest old? of bulbs. How old is he? How 31 old is he? years 31, of age. Yeah, okay. 31 years of age. You lived in New Jersey. I did, yeah, that's where I grew and up. And you are the sister of Katie Lang? The lesbian. <laughs> no, well, no, she, I'm no, I'm not related to her, but I wouldn't be someone's sister. I'd be a brother. You would be the brother, of course. <laughs> right. One person said to me that I looked so damn boyish. They said, oh my God, you look so damn boyish. At first I thought you were Katie Lang. <laughs> I didn't know who she was at the time, but it was a wonderful compliment. <laughs> <laughs> I, oh my goodness, you did a show called Live on Tape. I don't want to hear about that. <laughs> Have you talked about Mad TV? No, I What's don't think Mad so. TV? It's a show on Fox. You really had not much of a career, have you? <laughs> no, no. And so let me guess. I'm talking to you right. because I, you're on the cast and it would be awkward without it. Right, I guess so. That's wonderful. This is just filler. Well, Artie Lang, it's been wonderful talking to you. I don't think we'll use it, but it's still good to have it on tape for private functions. <laughs> This is Jimmy Glick. The show is Lala Wood. We're at the Norm set. <laughs> I've been moderately interested. Thank you.